On today, I want to spend just a few moments giving you what I call a life nugget. I'm Tanya Wilson Cherry, growth strategist, business coach, and mentor to women's service based business owners just like you. And today, I want to take a moment just to give you a tool that you can use if you feel like you keep getting these repeated unwanted cycles in your life or in your business. So as a business coach, I noticed that many of my clients would come to me with the same information, the same scenario, and some would soar, and then some not so much. And it prompted me to begin understanding what was actually transpiring. It was actually the thing that caused me to push forward and become a certified life coach, in addition to becoming a business coach. And I learned that what we do as life coaches is designed to help you empower yourself so that you can create futures bigger than your past. And oftentimes it means relearning some things from the past that we used to do or things from the past that are showing up continuously in our right now. So we wanna get those things out of the way. And one of the biggest spaces to move forward is always from a space of clarity. So I want to give you a quick clarity session, something you can do on your own. I believe that coaching yourself is one of the strongest things that you can do. I actually teach this inside of 3D Success Academy for women in business, but on a much broader scale. But I know that you will find it valuable and be able to still use some of these simple principles that I give you today. And it's simply three questions that you're going to ask yourself. The first question, and the reason why I'm saying this, guys, it's because we're attracting things all the time. So the first question is, how did I attract this into my life or into my business? Now, I know life doesn't have a set of instructions. Well, there is this book that I love to read that has quite a few instructions. However, I understand that we can't control the people that we are connected to, right? And what I mean by that is sometimes we'll encounter people that you know, may throw us off a little bit, but what we can control is what we allow, right? And so I, when I think about uh, we are, whatever is transpiring in our life right now, we're attracting, it's usually from two places, what we're allowing or what we simply don't understand. And so if there is something that's happening in your business or in your life that you don't like, know that you can change it. And one of the first questions you wanna ask yourself is, how did I attract this into my life? Now, sometimes we attract things into our life and business because we make decisions out of desperation. Maybe it's someone you hired and you're like, uh-oh, I didn't see that. We may have hired from a place of desperation instead of a place of purpose. We sometimes have relationships in our life that are, that are out of desperation and not out of purpose. So the first question is, ask yourself, how did I attract this into my life. Second question, second question or second scenario, what lesson did I learn from this? It's so important that we can reflect, take a moment of reflection and decide the lesson that you learn from this. Once you are in a space of awareness of what you learn, you're more likely not to revisit that same thing again. And so often what happens to us in life is we keep repeating our patterns and repeating our habits. And once we become aware of the habit, the thought, the thing that we did to attract it, remember I said attracting can be looked at from what we allowed, right? Or what we simply didn't understand, but how we attracted it into our life. Once we're aware of that, we can now create a strategy to not do it again. So the third question you wanna ask yourself is, now how do I reposition? So we understand this is the reality of my right now but it is not the determination of my future. So your third question to ask yourself is, how do I reposition? Now I'm a writer, so I believe in writing things down. I have a gratitude journal. I write things in journals and pamphlets all the time. Actually, our broadcast for today is on paper, um, just to give me points to make sure I gave you full value. So I want you to write down the answers that you actually say. Remember, nobody else is reading this but you. Listen, this is a life nugget that's going to help you if you feel you're having repeated cycles of, um, in your life or in your business. Maybe it's failed business attempts that keep recurring over again. You have to stop and take a moment of reflection and say, how did I attract this into my life? Sometimes, right, 
we attract things out of desperation because we made a desperate business move or we made a desperate move in connecting partnerships, collaborations. But take time, always take time to reflect. That's my life nugget for you today. For those of you who have never been on a video before and you'd like to get more videos and more trainings, be sure to subscribe if you're on YouTube, hit like or get notifications if you're on a different social media platform. I am Tanya Wilson Cherry, your growth strategist, business coach and mentor, and the founder of 3D Success Academy. Our academy is for women in business just like you, founded on three core pillars, your destiny, your dollars, and your disciplines. If you're looking to brand, build, or profit your business in the next level, be sure to join us inside the academy.